welcome. This is the Cut to the Chase podcast show. I'm your host, the Boo Knife, with my co-host, Jay Kim. We give you that real chop, you understand that? We discuss sports, entertainment, current events, food, and just common sense. Tune in and subscribe. Ah, good morning, good morning. Or it could be nighttime, you know, middle of the day. This is your host, the Bowie Knife, in the studio solo today again. Jay Poo's coming on right after this. But today we're going to go ahead and talk about vacations. Yep, that's right, vacations. But you know, give me a second, I got to change this music. I'm working by myself, so, you know, we're going to do this together. Give me one second, I'm change this music. There you go. So anyway, you know you need one. You already know. And vacation. Yeah, so let's talk about it. You know, when we go to work, most of us work, you know, um, we tend to get focused on our bills and we start putting paychecks on top of paychecks and looking at the future and stacking these hours up and then cashing them out every every week and every two weeks, whatever, however you do it. But you sometimes, you know, you need to take some time to yourself and just let the air out, relax, enjoy the fruit, fruits of your labor, um, and just kind of realize that life is more than just working. You know what I mean? So, that's a guy concept of vacation a lot of people sometimes because they're paying bills and stuff they don't even have the money to get out there and just enjoy themselves get memories you know things to look back on things to look forward to next year or six months from now or things like that it could be something like a road trip it doesn't have to be anything extravagant it can be a road trip. Just hit some rest stops to the next state, stay the night in the hotel, have dinner, and then come back. You know, but you got to do it, man. Hey, if, yeah, you're probably at work right now thinking you need a vacation. So, you know, me, I'm, I'm, I got caviar taste. So, you know, I'm trying to go on a cruise. You know what I'm saying? So let me just pull up one of my cruise lines. Let's see. Let's go to Carnival. All right, let's go. It looks like you could do a three-day Bahamas cruise that goes to Nassau and it leaves Miami for a little bit of nothing, like a car payment. So the thing is, you got to get to Miami. You know, uh, I'm looking. Let's go. You know, I want to go somewhere like Aruba. You know what I'm saying? I want to go where everybody's skin is all tanned up and stuff. You know what I mean? <laughs> uh, I want to go to Australia. I want to I want to see a seven-foot-tall kangaroo. So, I mean, where do you want to go? I mean, say you had the choice to go anywhere you wanted to go in the world. Where would you want to go? My choice would probably be Paris. Sitting in Venice, sipping on coffee, eating crepes. You know. I, but I want to know. You tell me. If you had a choice, where would you go on your vacation? You know, anywhere. I definitely want to visit Canada. I heard they like brothers up there, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> you understand that? So anyway, think about it, plan it out, start putting a little money away. You know, every paycheck, $50, $25, put it in an account. And you go to Priceline or somewhere. And then get your vacation, man. Take that time to yourself. Get the memories before you get too old and you can't do it no more. You feel me? Go out there. Take somebody with you. Again, this is the Bowie Knife. We got Jay Poo coming on next. He probably got some big back activity. Go ahead and stay tuned. And again, enjoy your day. Be safe. Do something good. And God bless. Get back to this coffee because it is off the hook. Holla back.